Hey cats, my name is Snowcat15, and welcome to Niche, a genetic survival game. If you're new to this channel, you might notice all of my videos consist of Minecraft videos, but while that's true, I'm looking to expand the variety of my videos, and since Niche is one of my favorite games, I think it's, uh, I think it's great to just play this game because I like it. Anyway, so as you can see, I have two creatures, and they each have three turns, and that's how this game works. So, my main objective for this game is just to fill out the mutation menu, as you can see, like, a bunch of them are unlocked, or are locked, so, um, I need to fill that out. And there is a story mode to this game, which acts as kind of a tutorial, but I'd rather just experience the game as a challenge instead of just doing a story mode. So as you can see we have Snow and Hurricane, and Hurricane is going to be our namesake of this tribe. So I've also got like a bunch of names to name our future children, stuff like that. So we're just gonna start clearing this area for nesting material, and on to the next turn. So yeah, like I said, these two creatures have only one, I mean three turns, and we have a child so far, but that's kind of it. So we're gonna have to build our family a lot faster than how we are currently. Oh, looks like he got a leech. Sorry, Hurricane. Ugh. So far, so good. I'm currently on a hard island, so it's good. It, this, and our two ports is this mountain filled with bones, and then there's the jungle ports, which I think we're gonna go with the jungle ports because the deadly mountains are nothing to sneeze at. And since we're two kind of basic nichelings here, I don't think it'll be a smart idea to go there and possibly starve. So, we have our new baby here. That's great. Let me just pull out the name, and we're gonna go with Rain. That's a great name. All of these names will be kind of nature-related, but I think our main little segment of our family will be named after storms, because it's called the Hurricane Drive, so I don't see why not. All right. So now that our baby is old enough to get out of the nest, I'll just place her there. And, oh, I forgot to do the mutations for this family. Let's see here. So she's got normal eyes. She's got brown eyes. Oh, that's... That's something. And, yeah, she's... Snow is pretty healthy, and if we look at Hurricane, he doesn't have any horns, but we can't really do anything about that. And he has two black eyes, and... A mask. So I think for this tribe we're gonna go with kind of the spots. Spots. Okay, there we go. <laughs> As our main pattern, because that kind of signifies our little, you know, a storm. So let's just start putting that in their mutation menu, because I'm not sure if we'll be able to unlock anything new while they're alive. So let's just breed again. And, yeah, this is the beginning of our storm tribe, and, I don't know, we do have another port over here that's to Adam's Island, but I don't think we're gonna go to Adam's Island, because they'd probably just ignore us, because we're in sandbox mode, so, there you go. Alright, looks like we have our next one, and she's brown, which is definitely not what we're looking for, but fortunately she has those spots. So let's see, here... I think she'll be named Marsh. Oh, no. Marsh. There we go. Yeah, she's definitely not look she's definitely not what we're looking for, but she's she's acceptable. We can't really be picky here. But yeah, we're really looking for that gray fur and maybe like a better snout, like maybe big snout or um, poison things, but I'm not sure. We're gonna have to find a wanderer with those genes. Oh! Yeah, I... I literally just said a wanderer, and we have a wanderer. That's great. And she does not have any big nose or anything, but she 
it's definitely better than, say, Spit Snout or... Yeah, Spit Snout. Okay, well anyway. We're just gonna pick more berries so we don't starve and stuff. So, we're, we really need a male for our lovely... Uh, I forgot to name her, hold on. Ma Mariana? I don't know. I'm sorry for my terrible pronunciations. So, I think I'm going to name her... Um, I guess Juniper, because she's very colored. Nice. Alright, so she does have that cracker jaw, which is extremely useful. Unfortunately, she doesn't have, like, nimble fingers, because I feel like nimble fingers would definitely be helpful if we wanted to go to the mountains or something. So, let's just keep breeding. But, yeah, we can bring one, two... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh! 15 creatures! That's great! We don't have to, like, limit our supply too much. Anyway, let's just clear out some more grass, and let's skip to the next day. Oh, another gray one! Oh, look at those pattern. I don't know. But she's great. She looks like she kind of has mud on her. That's... <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. Alright, I think we're gonna name her Breeze. As you can see, I'm not really naming them after too much stormy things, because I think we're just waiting for our next leader. I think Rain is definitely lined up to be our next leader, because she's got those lovely horns. And she looks just like her mother. It's That's great. Well, she doesn't look just like, but she, she kind of does. I don't even know what I'm talking about. This is my first video in a very, a very long time, and I apologize for that. So, I'm just trying to kick off my channel again for a fresh new start. So, I hope you like this kind of content, I guess. So, I don't know. Like, Minecraft videos will probably still be a theme on this channel, but eh, it's always good to differen differentiate. I'm sorry. I don't know how to talk today, apparently, but, uh, again, she's, Breeze is a female, which, uh, normally I'd be fine with it, but we currently have all females, and that's a bit concerning, so let's keep trying to get a male, and once we get a male, I think we can stop safely. Alright, so let's start working on getting those nimble fingers in the mutation menu. And perhaps the cracker jaw, because we have Juniper, Jun Juniper here helping. Ugh, I don't even know what I'm doing. Anyway, so we also need to practice attacking things so we can mutate in that claw, which would be helpful for the jungle. Oh, there's a mole there. And, you know, for hunting. Thanks, mole, for demonstrating that. And there's a crabbit here, so... Things are definitely spawning. Oh, we have a male. Oh, great. So, again, I said that we would stop once we get a male, so I think we're gonna stop. Let's see. What we're gonna we're gonna name you? Uh, let's see here. I think we're gonna name you. Um. Hmm. I think we're gonna name you Gust. We're gonna have some pretty tame names for now, but yeah, I I definitely think Rain is gonna be lined up for a new. Oh. Who are you? Oh my god. There are a lot of wanderers here, aren't they? Alright, we're gonna invite you in. Uh, there we go. And I forgot to check the immunity genes, so that... Yeah. Duke Von Rowe, who we're, we're gonna <laughs> rename you, I think it's pretty appropriate, because he has albinism. We're gonna name him Blizzard. Alright, welcome to the family, Blizz Blizzard. Uh, I can't talk, but <laughs> how fitting. There, There's a nest here. Alright. So, I think we're going to have them breed, because he has those nimble fingers, but I'm going to check out his mutation menu. He has hemophilia and bad eyesight, but other than that, he has fishing tail, which is good if we want to get the fishing tail in the um, immunity mutation thing. Alright, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. Alright, let's start and get these normal eyes on here, and I think we're going to breed... If we can. Okay, it worked. <laughs> I got a little nervous there. I don't know. So we have... Oh, we're running out of food, aren't we? Okay, that that's a little concerning. I don't 
I think we should probably stop. Like, actually stop now. Ugh. Alright, so I'm very happy with how we're doing now because we got a wanderer with, you know, nimble fingers. And that's pretty good. So we don't have to, like, you know, waste more turns trying to grab those berries. Because we are running out of food, like I said. So let's see here. Let's take a look at your... Yeah, she, she, Rain is really healthy. Okay. So she doesn't have any spots because she was our first child. So let's just put those in there. And maybe blue eyes to signify the sky. I, I don't know. I'm just kind of going off of anything. But we have a lot of um, digging paws in this tribe. And though digging paw is kind of useful, it only really gives you one root, and you have to like find a bunch of roots. So yeah, I think nimble fingers will definitely be an improvement. So let's just start moving inland. I don't think we have to spend a lot of time here, but it might be nice to clear out the whole island and then go to the jungle island, because I'm not sure if we're going to be ready, because literally none of us are really ready for anything here, and I really actually need to mutate in the black fur. That, yeah. Whoops, alright. So, let's just put that in Juniper's mutation menu, because, yeah, we're definitely gonna need some help in the jungle, it's just so we don't have to, like, cheat to survive, or worse, just go extinct. That, that would be pretty ter terrible. Ugh. Alright, anyway, let's see here. Yeah, she has webbed hind legs and stinky tail. Okay, stinky tail is definitely going to be super useful. Uh, other than that, she's pretty good. So I think I'm going to put black fur. And then she's got those webbed hind legs. But I'm not sure if that's really a threat so far. So I'm just going to put the black fur in there. I hope that's not too troubling to any of you. And we're just going to skip the day. Oh! <gasps> Black fur! Oh, this is perfect. Alright, he doesn't have any spots, unfortunately, but <laughs> that's great. Alright, let's see here. Let's just look at this, and I think we're going to name our new family here Soul. Because, I don't know, Soul stands for sun, but I don't know, it just seems like it fits. Sorry if that makes no sense to you guys. Um, Anyway, so we're going to halt the quest, our little, just, we're gonna halt the production of our children here because we are, we're running out of food and, uh, that's not good. So we're just gonna have Juniper grab some more food. Thank you, Juniper. You're our first, you know, honorary member. And she brings great, oh, she has the same immunity genes as... Her- wait, nope, that's- I didn't plan on breeding him anyway. It's this guy. This guy. Okay, no- oh, this is bad. Okay. What about- what about Blizzard? Okay, Blizzard is fine, but that- that's a little troubling. She, a lot of us have D, and, um, that might not be good. Oh, bunnies! Okay, we killed it. I'm glad it didn't move. Yeah, we're definitely running out of food. Oh, there's another one. Uh, okay. Um, so I guess we're gonna have to look for roots. I know I said that they weren't a very good s food source, and yeah, they're not, but they're at least some food source, so, mm. Ugh. Okay, this is- okay, it's raining, that's good. That means all of the berries have replenished, and we can finally start getting more food. Because if we're gonna survive in the jungle, we're definitely gonna need a lot of food. I'm pretty sure there's only like, I don't know, freaking poison berry bushes, and I think the normal berry bushes are kind of rare. So this this is gonna be pretty interesting if I do say so myself. Uh, I think we might want to consider going to the mountains where we can get new genes or something. I don't know. This is a little concerning. But I think that's where we're going to end off our new episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it's a little boring because I definitely have not recorded in so long. Yeah. But yeah, just 
just bear with me, guys. I think this series will definitely get better as we go on. Yeah, so tell me, if you are interested, where would you like to go? Would you like to go to the mountains where we can find new prehistoric genes? Or would you like to go to the jungle where we can probably unlock that stinky tail? Or get mauled by apes, I guess. So, yep, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my new comeback, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Thank you.